Hi, what you see here is Motorola G100 running Lineage OS 18.1 or Android 11. This phone supports dual displays. One display is this LCD screen and the other display is the TV monitor that you see in front of you connected through this USB Type-C hub. This is a simpler hub, but you can get a more complex hub which will support multiple USB devices. In other words, you can convert this phone to a full function Linux PC. So let me show you the settings. This is Motorola Edge S, which is the same as Motorola G100. Also, I had to enable desktop mode on the settings. It's still an experimental feature, but it seems to work quite well. Let me see where it has gone. Okay, here. Force desktop mode enable free form windows. This allows you to kind of bring it like a sure desktop style interface on Android. I've already installed uh, Folks PC desktop on this device. So I'm going to just start it. So we, this is a new port and we support both the Raspberry Pi 4 and this device and also Android x86. Uh, for more details, you can look at my Raspberry Pi 4, older videos of Raspberry Pi 4. I'm just going to go over the, what is new on this release. So this is basically XFC Debian Bullseye running a 64-bit distribution. We recently changed the default background and the theme. It looks much prettier now. Uh, on the Raspberry Pi 4, Firefox browser was a little bit sluggish, but with this phone... Uh, if you're thinking about buying solar panels, just so much more the US powerful. Government. You can uh, you very quickly load pages and uh, it's it's more like a regular desktop. Like I said, this is a Snapdragon 870, which runs at a top speed of 3.2 gigahertz, and uh, you know it's very it's a very fast uh, ARM Linux PC. In fact, I would claim it's the fastest ARM Linux PC that that you can fit in that you can put in your pocket. And besides that, it's got a built-in 5G connection. You know, you have about, uh, after you boot up, you have about 5 GB still available. So there's loads of memory. You can switch back to the Android if you, if you want to. You can come back to the desktop. You can also launch uh, other browser you know, for a more detailed view, you can look at our Raspberry Pi 4 video. Uh, you know, while you're, while you're running the desktop, the phone functionality is fully available. In fact, uh, you can make and you can take phone calls and make phone calls because we are running as an application on top of Android. Uh, for example, you could also be, you know, edi editing a document Let us see, editing a document, and uh, and you need to, you know, leave in a hurry. You can always disconnect the phone from this hub. All the intelligence is, is already available, is already done on the phone, so you really don't need to worry about losing any work. And you can come back, come back to your phone anytime later, Connect it back to the, your hub, 
and go back to your desktop. So you have your application still running. Of course, I would be safe and save the document that you were editing. So that way, in case you have to reboot your PC, you don't uh, you don't lose your work. Anyway, so that's it, folks. Basically, what you what I've shown you is the fastest ARM Linux PC that you can put in your pocket, and which also has a 5G connection. Thank you very much.